So Chris, what about this beautiful tree that's been brought down? What's happened here? Yeah, well, um, it was a beautiful tree, I guess. Uh, a nice oak tree that uh, we planted back in about 1987 or 88. Um, it had actually been very, very bad, badly damaged by grey squirrels when it was aged about 15, and nearly all the oak on this site that's happened to. Anyway, the beavers have felled this into the stream and they've started to strip off the bark and move um, uh, branches to put into the dam. Um, if the uh, tree just stayed here, eventually it would just become a lovely deadwood habitat for all sorts of uh, insects and invertebrates. But in fact, I think what I'm going to do after a little while when I've got nothing better to do one day is come down with a chainsaw and take away that bottom trunk because it's making a, a, a perfect uh, fence a strainer post and it's already been sharpened at one end so it couldn't be better. And so is this good for this environment because it looks like it, it looks quite, quite a severe thing to happen to a, an area within the woodland. Um, what it tends to do is it let a lot more light in and with more light you get more ground vegetation coming uh, and the beavers actually do eat a lot of that. And certainly um, lots of other animals can exploit that as well. And as a farmer, and we do let cattle in to graze sometimes, having these areas where the, the trees have been removed and there's more ground vegetation coming up, it's very good for them uh, in terms of providing a, a resource. Um, and the other thing is, of course, is this is a, a, a very natural kind of uh, event. Um, and the beavers are doing what we do when we go coppicing things and also what elephants do in uh, different kinds of environment, or indeed in this environment uh, uh, a few thousand years ago. So uh, I don't see it as being particularly catastrophic. Catastrophic for that tree maybe, but the tree itself, the, the stump is still alive and has a potential to coppice too. So um, I think it's not, um, in fact you can see coppice shoots coming off that one just there already, and that, that one only went down a couple of months ago and already it's sprouting into life.